Well, today we're highlighting a new project that is giving a boost to local communities. Joining us now is author and blogger Francesca Ramsey, along with two young changemakers who are being recognized for their efforts in local communities, changemakers Cutter Huston and Allison Platzmeyer. Thanks for coming on our show today. Thank you. Francesca, please tell us about the What Comes Next project. So the What Comes Next project is all about celebrating individuals who are taking initiative and harnessing the power of clean in their communities. So Clorox partnered with DoSomething.org to identify five young changemakers and they were each given grants of $15,000 to put that money into the projects in their communities. Cutter, tell us about your project. You received a grant from the What Comes Next project. Yeah, so I work with an organization called the Laundry Project, um, and we open the doors to local laundromats and allow um, members of the community to come in and wash their clothes completely for free. Uh, they'll have access to all the supplies you need to wash clothes, like detergent and softener. Um, and it's, it's really amazing to see how impactful uh, clean laundry can be on the confidence levels of the people that we serve. Allison, what did you do in your community and did the people enjoy your project? Yeah, they did. Um, my project was called Close the Loop and so we collect um, the donations that are typically turned down by other charities uh, like severely stained or tattered or torn clothes and make sure that they're upcycled, repurposed or um, recycled to make sure that they get back in the hands of people in need. How rewarding was the project for you? When the, when the guests come in a laundromat uh, for my project they tend to be kind of closed off and reserved but as they uh, realize that we're just doing this out of the good of our hearts and they're able to kind of empower their, their lives through the power of clean laundry they open up to me and and it's really inspiring to be able to hear their stories um, and to know that the work that I'm doing is the reason why they uh, feel so confident and be able to move on in their lives. Our thanks to all of you for coming on the show today. Thank you. Thank, Thank you. you. Check out businessfirstam.com to find out where to see our entire show. And don't forget to like, follow, and share Business First AM.